Remember the winter of 2007? Way back then, we had to keep warm with blankets. Blankets that had no sleeves. How did we survive? Now, there's the Snuggie, the blanket that has sleeves. The Snuggie keeps you totally warm. As you're watching this broadcast, you may very well be wearing a Snuggie. Perfect for men, women, and children, too. 20 million Snuggies have sold since its debut in 2008. From the world of fashion to late night TV. Oh, let's call it what it really is, a full length bib. <laughs> America has swaddled itself in the Snuggie. Even the family dog. Congratulations, we have set a Guinness World Record Guinness. Just this month, over 20,000 Cleveland Cavalier fans donned Snuggies, setting a world record. I had a story from a friend of mine whose, whose grandmother knitted her daughter a Afghan for, for the holidays. And when the grandmother came and the daughter opened it up, she said, Grandma, this is great, but where's the sleeves? Gravity takes hold. And when the Scott plane, Boylan is president of All Star, maker of Aqua Globes, the Big Top Cupcake, and Benderoos. But none of his products has become the cultural phenomenon that Snuggie has. Every Snuggie for kids comes with a bonus pair of matching slipper socks. Snuggie has smothered the competition. Competition? That's right. Snuggie wasn't first. It was close to zero degrees, and I was beneath my blanket, a normal blanket that didn't have sleeves, and we had a really old TV so the remote signal wouldn't pass through. In 1997, uh, Gary Clegg was a freshman at the University of Maine. I cut a hole in my blanket to poke the remote through so I could continue channel surfing. And that is uh, when the idea came. That idea? The slanket. Clegg's mother made him his first blanket with sleeves. Soon enough, a business was born, at first on chat sites and blogs. He couldn't afford TV ads. This is the Slanket, the original, the genuine. Uh, but by 2007, um, yeah, uh, he was hawking Slankets on QVC. And asked my mom, could you please make me a blanket with sleeves? You know how indebted you are to her now, right? Of, of course. <laughs> I love my mother. One of our first times on QVC, I think we sold something around 17,000 units in 11 minutes. Wow. The slanket wasn't patentable, though. <laughs> After all, it's basically a backward robe. This is very warm, and it's a lot of it. Exactly. And when the economy turned south, the Snuggie snuck right in. We did have the unique timing of the recession. The car companies and the financials all pulled out of the advertising market. So there was a 90-day window back in, in the fall of 2008. We swooped in and we ran every bit of media we could. That's right. Get on your Available in luxurious leopard, stunning zebra. The world's favorite blanket with sleeves is now... That's my size. The Snuggie ads blanketed the airwaves, but these weren't just any ads. They were nostalgic and kitschy, intentionally so. And with Snuggie, you can get up and still stay warm. You're willing to admit that the premise of the ad is a little bit absurd. No, absolutely. I mean, it was definitely a little over the top. Now there's a new product called Blanket. With the Snug Wow, you'll never have to get up again. The Snuggie has been roundly mocked, and no one's laughed harder than Scott Boylan. People call me all the time and say, how'd you make that happen? That you can't just make happen. Sometimes on a product that just happens and you have to go with it and now be a good enough company to build it into a long-term brand. Right. Perfect for men. But hold on, sorry to sound like a wet blanket. What about quality? Obviously you believe the slanket is higher quality than the Snuggie. Oh yeah, I mean, I think it's scientifically proven. Indeed, Consumer Reports wrote that after 10 wash and dry cycles, the Snuggie had pilled and clumped. But don't tell that to the crowd at this Snuggie bar crawl in San Francisco. So which blanket with sleeves is better? Maybe it's time for a sleep off.